Hi guys, this is Lena at GradeLink again. Thanks for joining me for the financial webinar uh, series. This is video eight. In the last video, we configured our reduced lunch fee types for our reduced rate lunches. Now I'm going to show you how to place particular students onto a reduced rate lunch program. Um, so that for particular students, they're charged the reduced rate if need be. Again, if you're not making use of the lunch billing feature in GradeLink Financial, please feel free to skip over this video and look at the next video. Um, let's jump in here. I'm going to now apply um, a particular student onto a reduced rate lunch plan. And so first I would click on the Students tab in the upper left. And then I would select the student that I want to um, place on the reduced rate program. And so in this case, I'm going to click on Julie here. And I have the main uh, tab selected when I first click on her name. And then I have the demographics button selected. But I actually want to jump over here to the documents at the top of the page. Once I click on documents, I want to select assistance. When I check the assistance box, then this area opens up that says Financial Assistance Programs. Below Financial Assistance Programs is a field next to the word Codes. When I click on Codes, then I see Lunch Program Reduced Fee available to me here. So I've already set up fee types that, are cor that correspond with this code. Uh, so now if Julie is charged for any of those uh, fee types, then her rate will be reduced. I'm going to click Save. Uh, and it's, uh, it's that simple there. So um, stay tuned. We're going to continue to work on setting up the financial section in the next video. At the beginning of the year, you would just go through here and um, place the students onto the reduced fee if need be. Thanks, guys. Stay tuned.